Behind me is one of the biggest houses in Mexico, and I'm about to sneak inside. The caretakers are right there. There's people in the backyard. I don't know how I'm gonna do this. And that's not all. I will also be sneaking into a luxury restaurant and a five-star hotel. And some of these places are heavily guarded, making it very hard to sneak into, but not impossible. And it all starts here at this luxury restaurant where I will sneak inside and order food without making a reservation. I'm just walking in, I'm walking in, I'm walking in. There is nobody here. This place was not very hard to sneak into. Very easy at most, like walking into a McDonald's. But trust me, it'll get way harder to sneak into these locations. Just wait for the next one. But I guess now, I just enjoy my meal. Based off of curb appeal, this thing looks amazing. After eating this meal, I would give it a solid five. It wasn't my cup of tea, but I'm sure it's, it's someone somewhere. But one thing I did know about sneaking into restaurants is that you don't actually have to pay the bill. So this meal is on the house. And just like that, we're out. On to the next one. And this is where the difficulty increases. Because these next places are not easy to sneak into. Not at all. And now, we're here. This isn't actually the hotel behind me, it's right over here. It may not look like much from the outside, but the inside is amazing. This place is rated an astounding five stars. And you may be wondering, what is my plan to get inside? Well, it's actually quite easy. I'm gonna be waiting by that front door for a family to walk in. And when they're about to walk in, I'm gonna pretend to be one of their kids and walk in with them. This should be pretty easy. I know kids pretty well, so I should be able to act as one pretty well. Now, all that's left to do is just wait. <laughs> also, I forgot to mention I dressed really nice, just like I did with the restaurant, just to see if that gave me an advantage. I've been waiting here for over 40 minutes. Not a single person has walked in. I'm just gonna try and walk in. There is someone at the door, but I think I can squeeze by. We're in, we're inside, we're inside. Oh shit, there are guard dogs on me. Hola, hola little guy. Shit, he's gonna go rat on me. Get back here, get, get here. We get are here. now on the second floor. There's so much character built into this place, it's just immense. I'm starting to think I'm not allowed to be here. I think I'm inside someone's hotel room. I can't believe we actually did it. We made it onto the very top floor. Just wait till I show you what I found downstairs. It's crazy. And now it's the moment you've all been waiting for. What I think the best part of this whole place is. The pool. But there seems to be no water in the pool, so that's gonna make it very difficult to go in the water. Because there's no water in the pool. Which will make it very difficult to go in the water. Because there's no water. But this is not the last of it. It gets better. Just wait for this house. But just as I was walking to the house, you won't believe who I saw. It's so beautiful. Is that Jeff Bezos? Is that Jeff Bezos? And not only did I see the billionaire, Jeffrey Bezos, I also found this. I wasn't intending on sneaking to this one either, but I did. I snuck in. And this is just the rooftop. And believe it or not, this one was actually way easier to sneak into. I literally just walked in. But this has to be one of the nicest ones I've snuck into. And before I sneak inside the house, I must do some recon. Because if I want to successfully sneak inside, I need a plan. There is a car here, so that means there's someone here. What are the odds we take this thing out for a spin too? None. And the biggest problem with these houses is that there's someone at the front gate all the time. But this time, there happened to not be. Let's just hope they're not there when I actually come and sneak inside here. And the reason why I chose to sneak in one of these houses is because there's no security cameras. At least I don't think. After walking around the whole property, there's three entry points. The front door, the side door, and the back. There's a bunch of people at the gate now. The caretakers are right there. There's people in the backyard. I don't know how I'm gonna do this. I think the best way of getting out of here now is taking the beach back. The only other way will be sneaking around here and just pray no one's down here. Okay, the good thing is this house looks empty. So I can sneak back here to the beach. Oh, shit. And just like that, we did it. I'm not gonna lie, that was the most stressful thing I've ever done. And it's only gonna get worse. So I packed my finest sneaky link materials and headed right back to the house. And since we found out the owners are actually there, this is gonna be way more difficult than we first thought. And just like that, we're back here. And something I didn't notice the first time I came here was that there was a door by the garage, which would make the perfect entry point. And lucky for me, I brought this shiesty all the way from Canada, so they'll have no idea what's happening. And you best believe I brought my bathing suit this time. But now, the moment of truth. I actually can't believe that worked. I can hear people outside. The front door's right here. They're out in the back patio right now and I need to get over there. I guess we just have to make a run for it. Here's the courtyard where I came from. But I still need to be pretty quiet because who knows if there's someone up here. I'm gonna take that this is one of the bedrooms. The artwork in here is insane. Looks like someone might be staying in here as well. I wanna get out of here as soon as possible. Oh, this is crazy. Someone is definitely staying in here. Look at this, bro. They're right down there. I feel like now is also a good time to say that what I'm doing is not good and you should probably not attempt this. And I'm just now realizing that they have security cameras in here. Now we're about to go in the very last room. 
I gotta be fast, but there's one more thing I wanted to do before I left. Uh, I'd imagine that's what it would look like to wake up here. That's, that's all I wanted to do. The only possible way for me to get outside is going the way I came in, and they're still outside in the patio. So I have to make this quick. The door's not shutting. Whatever. This mission isn't over yet. I still need to get in their pool. I think the only way I'm doing that is by waiting here and waiting for them to go inside. I think I just heard a car start. This could not have ended better. The house is completely empty. I think I'm in the clear. I gotta do this fast and really quiet. This is the only chance I'll get to do this. We did it. And we're gonna leave the same way we left last time. Through the beach.